So Adam, how did the event today go? Went really well, Michael, thank you. Yes, uh, we had a really diverse group of people who were all very interesting and brought a lot of different perspectives uh, to the group. I personally learned a lot about different things that are happening within the region and nationally, actually. And um, yeah, it went really well. And did you find the four or five blockages that might make a difference? Yes, I think we did. One of the most positive things to come out of this has been from such a diverse group of people who comprise festivals, fine art organisations, um, cultural organisations like National Trust and so on who don't have a direct answer even. What came out was how much there is a consensus around some often quite simple and achievable actions which would make a difference to getting more better quality art out into public spaces. And what are the next steps? What's going to happen next? Uh, the next steps are for me to go away, have a think, write up what's been done, uh, to go and talk to my colleagues about how it fits in with their knowledge and their agendas and what's going on for them. And then we have a great sounding board which has come out of the wider group, which is a smaller amount of people to check in with about next steps, which, which I will do so. Um, and that will probably be towards the end of February and that will be working towards some kind of event, I hope, around the end of March, beginning of April. Oh. And what will happen at that event? I'm, I'm dropping the gun talking about that event. I should be talking about that event. It's just so exciting. I think that one of the things that came out of today was how many more people could be involved, how much more expertise there is in the region, and in fact, how useful simply getting people together in a room is. And so, in the back of my mind, I'm imagining a larger event with focus around two or three issues, which enables a mixture of kind of information exchange and developing ideas around you know, future work, but which also simply is about networking and enabling new partnerships to take place. Is art and culture in the public space important for Arts Council Southwest? Yes, it is. Um, and I think that there is a, a real sense that there's a regional strength around great urban and rural spaces and great artists that we have in the region. The, the, the power of those two put together has a real potential to engage more people, which is about what Arts Council 10-year strategy about, which is achieving great art for everyone.